Today, I want to talk to you about a powerful emotion that has the potential to change lives and shape our world for the better. Gratitude. Gratitude is a simple yet profound feeling of thankfulness and appreciation for the blessings, kindness, and opportunities we encounter in our lives. It is an attitude that can bring happiness, contentment, and a sense of fulfillment. I have not always been the most optimistic, and I have often wanted to be a tad more, which at the end of the day has often led me to feel unsatisfied. To be honest, I may have been looking at it wrong. Yes, things have not always turned the way I wanted to in life, and I used to feel so much anger and resentment because all I could focus on was everything I did get. Everything that was missing from the picture that I had imagined as perfect. Better grades, more eye time, a higher position on the score sheet. I was so focused on what was missing that I could barely see what I had been blessed with. Health, a home, family, wonderful friends, and everything else that is not essential, but I just added value to my life. Last year, I lost my grandma. It all happened very quickly. She suddenly became very sick, and within less than a year, she was gone. One thing that has impressed me is that no matter what she was going through, when she was sick, not once did I ever hear her complain about it. It made me realize that my perspective might have been wrong, that life was good, regardless of my grades or the number of points that I had. I realized that being healthy and having a loving and supporting family, as well as a handful of significant friendships, is what matters most, especially when your life gets turned down, upside down by tragic events, such as illness and loss of loved ones. I realized that if I saw what was actually in my picture, Instead of focusing on what was missing from it, my life would still be the same, but I would feel much happier about it. So ever since my grandma passed away, I have included in my bedtime routine a moment to be grateful about the things that are going well in my life. When we practice gratitude, it has a ripple effect. It does not only benefit our own well-being and happiness, but it also extends to the people around us. By practicing, it affects our attitude in a positive way, which in turn has the power of uplifting others around us. It also helps us to see beyond the immediate circumstances as we learn to focus on much deeper and greater blessings. When we stop wasting energy on complaining about what we are not satisfied about, and instead make the effort to identify what brings us happiness, we are left with so much more energy that gives us strength to overcome obstacles and find silver linings in dark situations. So as we gather here today, I encourage you guys to take a moment to reflect on the abundance of blessings that surround us. Let us express our gratitude for the opportunities that have come our way, for the lessons hidden behind the failures, the blessings in disguise, and for the people who have supported and loved us unconditionally. One thing is for sure, tomorrow is not promised. In fact, I realize now how four years can go by so fast. It seems like yesterday, I stepped foot on campus for the first time. Back then, I was an angry kid, and to me, gratitude was only a word that Ms. Carellas would say before family sat at lunch. Now, with only a few days left as a student here, I understand how fortunate I am to have been here. I have received an excellent education. I have been blessed with lifelong friendships. And even if there, was, if there have been harder situations, I know time and reflection will eventually help me find a silver lining. As I'm standing before you here today, I would like to express my gratitude to those who have supported me for the past four years here at Sanson. My parents, my siblings, Gloria, the boys, my coaches, my teachers, my house directors, Mr. Pim for being a second dad and the best advisor, Mr. Spurk and Ms. Garrett for seeing the good in me before everyone else, the TODs, shout out to Ms. Guerrero, and, and everyone else who made my journey here an incredible one. May we never take for granted the life we have been given, and may we always find reasons to be grateful. Thank you.